Question. About this far plane. When somebody dies, a summoner sends them to the far plane, right? So their souls, or whatever they are, uh, they go to the far plane, right? But that's the far plane we're going to, right? And Yuna's old man's there too? Do dead people live there or something? Hmm. <laughs> you thinking those funny thoughts again, yeah? <laughs> You'll see once we get there. Aren't you coming? I do not belong there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're scared. Searching the past to find the future. This is all that is there. I need it not. You'd better be going. You're not really going to see the dead. More like your memories of them. People think of their relatives, and the pyreflies react to them. They take on the form of the dead person. An illusion, nothing else. Hmm. Well, have fun. What? You're not going either, Riku? I keep my memories inside. Huh? Memories are nice, but that's all they are. What the? The far plane was cool, but I couldn't stop thinking about Yuna. Her parents, they looked so happy together. But it got me worried that maybe seeing them would make Yuna really consider Seymour's proposal. Yo, Chapu! Meant to come see you earlier, yeah? Sorry. I know you won't hold it against me. Eh, I gave up that game. I'm a guardian from here on, you know? This guy looks a lot like you. Showed up. Traveling with him, I thought maybe you were still alive somewhere, yeah? But then again, here you are on the far plane. Guess your place is here. So, how you been? Oh, that guy I just told you about. I gave him your sword. He likes it. Huh? Wow. He is dead, and I am still alive. Coming here really makes that clear. I should focus more on what I have to do now. <laughs> what? What? I'm not even sure what I'm saying. Don't you mean that you should leave Chapu behind? 
I'm sure he was a great guy, but don't be others. Hmm, that's a possibility. Hmm, how about mm, Waka? What, me with Waka? Yeah, you two get along great. Getting along isn't enough, not even close. Oh, sorry, my mistake. You'd do well to remember that. Knowing a bit about women might come in handy someday. Yeah, I'll remember. I won't be forgetting either. Goodbye, Chapu. You always said I looked grumpy. But those were the happiest days of my life. Just a sec more. So, uh, Yuna? I've decided. Uh, oh, really? Uh, that's good. I remember when I was only seven years old in Bevel that day. My father had defeated Sin, and the whole town was out in the streets. Everyone was laughing. They all seemed so happy. If I defeated Sin, that would make everyone happy, wouldn't it? Uh, uh. I must do what everyone wants, not just what I want. Let's go back. You gotta tell Seymour. Before that, call Sir Jet. Give it a try. Huh? Don't worry. He won't come. Trying not to think about my old man? Made me think about him, of course. See, told you. He isn't here because he's not dead. He's Sin. <laughs> that means he's alive, you know. What if my old man really is Sin? What would I say to Yuna? Heck, uh, to everybody in Spira. Wait, why should I have to apologize for him anyway? I'd rather never see him again. What makes you hate him so? Everything he does just makes me mad. It was his fault that me and my mother... Uh, uh, Mom? It's her. She's very pretty. But... Wait. No one ever performed the sending for her. She must have accepted death while she was still alive. Whoa there. Uh, that's my mother you're talking about. Oh, I I'm sorry. Hmm. It's okay. Ah. Uh, I think I just... figured something out. What? Why I hate my old man. See? See? So, so I, told I told him what I thought of him right, right there. there. Really? Of course. <laughs> I suppose, but... Mommy! Just a sec, dear. Whenever my old man was around, my mother wouldn't even look at me. Maybe that's when I started to resent him, even hate him. When he left us, Mom just lost her energy. Is she all right? Why should you care? If she dies, I wouldn't know what to do. Don't say mom is gonna die. I apologize. The old lady next door told me, when a lovebird dies, the one left behind, it just gives up living so it can join its mate. It was just like that. I hated my old man even more. But really, my old man... Mommy! Just, Just a sec, dear. Ah, go to him. You'll cry if you don't. Oh, man. Hmm? I must sound so stupid. I don't think so. How embarrassing. Well, need some more time. No. I'm ready. Did I miss something? <laughs> Th 
Thanks for waiting. I'll go give my answer to Maester Seymour. <gasps> Lord Jisco! Oh, Lord Jisco! Uh, he does not belong here. Why? Yuna, send him. He is Lord Jiskel no more. Send him now. <laughs> Talk later. We leave now. What was that just now? That really Lord Disco? I don't understand how a man like Lord Jiskel can die and not be sent. I would think that he was sent once. But he stayed on Spira. Something, a powerful emotion, could have bound him to this world. Such things happen. That's against the rules, isn't it? It means he died an unclean death. I will go meet with Maester Seymour. Yuna! Jisco is the Guado's problem, not yours. Um. What? So, Lulu, what do you think about Yuna getting married? As long as the pilgrimage continues, either way's fine. That's it? What if she doesn't even like the guy? Is that okay? People marry for many reasons. What's that mean? Sometimes marriage doesn't require love, you know? Defeat sin and bring joy to the people of Spira. Get married and bring joy to the people of Spira. For Yuna, they're just two ways down the same road. All you need is determination. If you have that, you don't need love. I don't know. Mm, I just don't get it. As soon as Yuna returns, I trust you'll be ready. Listen, if Yuna gets married, then I... What? That again? Yes. If she is to marry, I would want her to marry for love. See? But, if Yuna said she wanted to marry the one she loves, I would have to object. Huh? Uh, you're not making much sense. I know. When we leave here, we have to go through the Thunder Plains next, you know? I can't stand thunder! Auto potions good, 
buy some before leaving. More than a guado at least, what do you say? More than a guado at least, what do you say? Good. Buy some before leaving. Lulu, 
I've talked enough about that. What? I'm sorry, just forget about it. Jeez, Grumpy. You'll understand one of these days. I just don't want to give it words, not yet. I shouldn't have to say this, but don't fall in love with her. I see, but you must keep your feelings inside until the pilgrimage is over. Summoner not with you? No. She's at Seymour's place. That's Maester Seymour, or Lord Seymour. Oh, I'll be careful. Sorry. That's all right. Oh, Maester Seymour left Guado Salam a short while ago. You serious? I believe he went to the temple in Makalania. Maester Seymour is also the high priest of that temple. Whoa! I gotta tell the others! Jisco, please, tell me. What can I do to help? Yuna, let's go! They say Seymour went to Macarena Temple. Makalania Temple. I? What I don't get is, why would the Lord Maester head off without a peep to anyone? Maybe he wasn't expecting Yuna's answer so soon. Ah, that's probably it. <sighs> Yuna, what is it? Oh, nothing. Hmm. You're a poor liar. It's true, it's nothing. Come on, let's go. supposed to cross that see the lightning rod towers the lightning is drawn to them hopefully we head north not too near and not too far from the towers yeah meaning we should avoid wide open areas ah! I think I forgot something in Guado Salam nice knowing you okay okay I'll go
Shield us from thunderous bane. Piece of cake! 